Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm about to show you how you can fix Rainbow Six Edge, how you can fix black screen. It's a problem that's pretty frequent and it's very common for all the a lot of players to they're having this problem, you know, and it's very annoying. So make sure you watch this video till the very end, because I'm gonna show you some some of the methods I've tested myself and it worked for me. And I hope it's gonna work for you as well. So Make sure you try all the methods and leave your results in the comment section. I'm very curious to see if it worked for you as well. And also join my YouTube, my Discord server where you, we can talk there, we can discuss, we can um, mainly help each other fix the problems. And now without further ado, let's jump right into the video. So what you have to do first to fix this problem, it's all, I always encourage people, but it's very overlooked and it might be very simplistic and very obvious to you, but it's really simple to update your Windows. But wait, not only that, we have here another an important thing is go to advanced options. It's here in advanced options. If you click on optional updates, here in optional updates, we have driver updates. And I know I'm saying this in a lot of my videos, but this video is how you can fix stuff, but it's very, I'm just going to be honest with you, this is very important. I usually see a lot of people that have this problem and it's just related to updates that uh, they don't have on your computer. So this list was really huge for me. So I just clicked on all the updates here and click on download and install. And now, what you also, another thing that you can do to fix this or prevent this from happening is to head over to Windows Updates and here, and here, let's go to, what is it, compatible accessibility and here in visual effects, make sure you turn the transparency effect off and animation effect and a little scroll effects, okay? You can also go here with, go in performance. There's another, another way here in performance. If you go in performance, you can also, uh, instead of best appearance, make sure you have here only to set on, okay? And also go to the game, again, go to compatibility, and in here in compatibility, make sure you turn this on, you turn this, um, run this program, compatibility mode, disable front, run this. Okay, all these settings, you have to have them on even only one disable full screen optimization and change high dpi settings and here make sure you check override and click on okay apply 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 and okay all right okay that's perfect now another thing that you can try is to really uh, install the latest updates by going to your manufacturer and clicking there on their official website intel amd GeForce for me, GeForce NVIDIA, so I'll just download this and then here as you can see I have the option to check for updates and click the latest updates. You always need to have the latest updates in, in order to run any game pretty much. So that's pretty much it. Please leave your results in the comment section and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Take care and I hope you're going to have a fantastic day.